You know, it's simple, really. Poaching, illegal wildlife trade. It's run by organized criminal networks. It's the same groups running drugs, trafficking in weapons, in humans, in conflict minerals. The issue of poaching was explained to me. It sounded very similar to how terror networks and insurgent networks operate. This radical new approach brings battle-tested military tactics into the fight to save wildlife. The same methods used to destroy terror networks are now being used to connect all the dots of information, giving authorities an enhanced picture of poaching activities. Key to our strategy is forming strong ties within the local communities. There will actually be an extra pair of eyes and ears so that they can provide security for wildlife. Because tips from locals can warn us when criminals enter the area. This grassroots intelligence is our strongest weapon. Analysts deliver reports right into the hands of field officers who can stay one step ahead of poaching networks. With the 10 bomber, then I tell you, no individual, no suspect will get his way free. And his days will be numbered. Kenya is a country that has consistently demonstrated its commitment to protecting elephants and other wildlife. With a strategic influx of funding, we can revolutionize KWS enforcement technology and procedures, saving elephants and stopping the poachers before they kill. It is a heritage for the world. It's not only for Kenya. We conserve for the people of the world.